Hey kids, what's your favorite thing to eat for lunch? Maybe it's a slice of pepperoni pizza, or maybe it's a big old cheeseburger. Well, in this lesson, we're going to see how Jesus made a little boy's lunch turn into something amazing. Huge crowds followed Jesus around. Jesus got pretty famous for all things he's doing. People loved to come watch him teach and do miracles. So he usually had a big crowd around him watching his every move. And one day he had an especially huge crowd listening to him teach. Jesus wanted to throw a picnic for the whole crowd. As the people listened to Jesus, they got hungry. He wanted to feed them. There was over 5,000 people there, so it was going to take a lot of food. So he asked his disciple Philip where they could buy some food for all of them. Philip told Jesus even if they worked for years and years and years, they would never have that much money to buy enough food. A little boy offered his lunch to feed the crowd. The little boy brought food for himself to eat, but he wanted to share it with everyone. So he offered five loaves of bread and two fish to feed to the crowd. That's a big lunch for a kid, but there's no way it's enough for 5,000 people. The little kid could have just kept it all to himself and eaten it up before anyone could ask him to share. But he decided helping Jesus was better than having a whole lunch to himself. So kids, here's the point of this lesson. God can do big things through little people. Jesus took that little kid's lunch and prayed over it. Then the disciples started passing out food for the people. And the food never ran out. Everyone got enough to eat and get filled up. There was even food left over. Jesus was able to perform this miracle because one little boy wanted to be generous. God can do big things, even with the littlest people. Memory verse. People should not think that small beginnings are unimportant. This story started with a small boy's lunch and ended up being something huge. So kids, next time you're eating your favorite lunch, think of this lesson. Jesus used a young kid to do a big thing and he can do the same thing to you. Hey kids and parents, if you want to learn more about generosity or Jesus' miracles, check out the links below.